What is a secondment agreement? Well, it's an agreement for a secondee. Well, thanks, Simon. That's about as helpful as a hole in the head. Fair enough. Stick around and I'll tell you. Hi, Simon here from the contract company, Contracts for Australian Businesses. That's what we do all day, every day, and sometimes overnight. Lucky us. I wasn't being flippant when I said a secondment agreement is the agreement for a secondee. Well, that's great. What is a secondee? Basically, it's your employee. So if you run a business and you have an employee and you want to allow that employee to go and work at a client's site for a period of time, then you would use a secondment agreement. Now, the employee, even though they're not physically based with you anymore, but they're actually sitting with your client for that period of time, they are still your employee. You still have to pay them. They still accrue employee entitlements as a normal employee. It's just that the only thing that's different is that they are sitting with the client. And the other thing that could be different is that they take direction while they're sitting with the client from the client. So let's use a classic example for us being in Canberra is that law firms are often asked to provide lawyers to government departments, say the Department of Defence. So where the lawyer, where the law firm places the lawyer with the Department of Defence, that would be covered by a secondment arrangement or a secondment agreement. The law firm still pays the employee. Defence pays the law firm for having them. That's how they make some money. Um, so while they're still being paid as an employee, while they're actually on Defence's site, they're usually subject to um, direction and instruction from the client. So they'll be sitting there and the person or people at Defence would say, right, we need you to do X, Y, and Z today, and off they'd go. So while they're sitting on the, de uh, the premises of the client, they're not actually under the, the real care and control of their employer because they're actually getting instructions from the employee, uh, sorry, from the client. Anyway, that's a secondment agreement, as I said, very common in Canberra. Um, and I think I've covered all the high points in them. Um, if you do have any questions about this video or in general, please feel free to get in touch. Simon at contractcompany.com.au or 1-800-355-455. Thanks very much.